Alright, so what's going on everybody? It's Chris here, and today I've got a regular commentary, finally. It's been a little bit since I last did any of these. The uh, last couple of days I've been... I've been live streaming Minecraft, I've been live streaming Black Ops 2. I've been... I just uploaded my first hardcore Minecraft episode, so that's gonna be there. Uh, probably every day, every two days, something along those lines. Uh, what else do I have? Uh, nothing really that much. I just haven't really bothered to actually go out and do some of these commentaries. The gameplay you're gonna see here is a domination game I joined about a minute and a half late. Uh, not late enough for me to get frustrated by joining, but also not uh, not right there from the start of course. So hey, I think I went 54-1 in this match using the, the Scar H with I don't know my regular loadout pretty much. Probably got Flag Jacket and Hardline, maybe Lightweight and flag jacket, and then toughness, dexterity. Probably got extreme conditioning in there too, and I've got quick draw and stock on it. Probably nothing else. And then my kill streaks are actually I only have two. Only a flag jacket hardline. I don't have extreme conditioning, which is kind of weird because if if I play on a map like this, freaking huge map turbine, I usually will try to uh, work my uh, loadouts around you know the the size of the map and get extreme conditioning in there but apparently I did in this game so nothing I can really do about that I guess but I, d I still did pretty well I think I only got a ruthless I didn't get a nuclear or anything you see right now I'm 12 and 1 so there's the match I'm not gonna die I'm gonna get 42 kills but apparently I didn't get that many gun kills uh, one and that's kinda good because it means my kill streaks did a lot of work for me but on the other hand I didn't get a lot of gun kills, which might make the gameplay less interesting. I don't, I don't know. This is one of the gameplays you just had sitting there still, I was trying to kind of remove all of them because I have whenever I stream, uh, the file of the stream actually gets saved to my hard drive, so I try to just remove a whole bunch of stuff. And I found this gameplay in it. I don't think I've used it yet, so that's why you're gonna see it right now. But a couple things I wanted to talk about, mainly the the kind of like the the tip oriented videos I wanted to do, like the nuclear ones and stuff. I think I'm gonna try to. I kind of implement those into live commentaries, so I'll try to kind of find a topic to talk about, like, um, I don't know if you want to bring up your score per minute, I'll go with the loadout that I would personally use if I wanted to get, like, a thousand score per minute match, and um, I'll try to kind of, you know, tell you about the stuff that's going through my mind when I'm playing, because that's a lot more important than kind of the stuff I can tell you when I'm not playing, because when I'm playing, that's kind of, you know, where the difference is made, where I do what I'm supposed to do, like, I can sit there all nice and uh, tell you about how you can get a nuclear but if I don't actually get the nuclear while I'm sitting there that's kind of pointless so I'll try to kind of talk you through what I'm actually doing when I'm doing it and why I'm doing what I'm doing and I'll try to kind of keep those separate from the live stream because the live stream is more more laid back and a little calm music in the background just play the game and um, yeah I'll try to do these live sessions probably once every two days I try to make that into a series where I just either try to go for a really high kill games or go for nuclears or just gun streaks or I'll try to use a certain certain weapon that people like to use and that I'll try to give tips out on. But yeah, the first round just ended. I'm 29 and 1. So that means that next round I'm going to go 25 and 0. And I, I don't know how it happened that I didn't get uh, any higher gun streaks. So that's something I've been working on a little bit. Actually, just, hey, that's something I can talk about. Uh, earlier, actually late yesterday, I reset my stats again. Uh, in my live stream, I'm going to be going for uh, Master Prestige. I'll try to go there as quickly as I can. I'll try to keep up my score per minute and all that, uh, which is pretty fun because that gives me something to kind of to kind of organize my live streams around. I cannot upload every single game, of course, in my live stream. That's going to be impossible. I cannot do a lot road to Commander because when I'm you know, when I'm up at late at night, I'll still play the game, but I can't live stream. So I'll try to, I don't know, do as much of that as possible. Do that like three, four hours a day. So you can come there, check that out. I'll put a live stream link in the description. You can check that out. It's going to be pretty interesting, especially because those are pretty much really, really long live com sessions. Uh, but like I said, I'll try to keep those a little bit calmer and stuff. I'm not going to be uh, talking the entire time because that's just impossible to do for that many hours at a row. But that's something I've been doing, lots of live streams, that's why I haven't really been going for lots of commentaries, because I just don't have the patience to really sit there for that long. 
Just doing the exact same thing. I'll try to mix it up a little bit, even though I'm still sitting here. Um, but yeah, live stream that's going on. The Minecraft stuff is going to be probably prominent on this channel. I don't know what I'm going to do with my other channel. I'll try to like do that for for highlight clips and stuff. If I get like a really nice streak, uh, that's like less than a minute or a really nice moment in Minecraft or whatever. I'll try to you know, upload that to there. And you can kind of use that as a as a little reference guide for hey that happened in that episode. I might go check that episode out. Uh, stuff like that, which is probably going to be interesting. Or it might not be, I might just be lazy and not upload anything ever. But um, yeah, this is going to be my main channel. So if you do enjoy any of the videos you've seen on here, go subscribe. Um, and also, of course, if you want to support me, go give it a like, leave a comment. Uh, to kind of give give out tips or anything for the things you want me to do or to see. Or if there's anything I do that annoys you, just tell me. And I'll try to try to work, work on whatever it is you tell me about. So yeah, the game is already pretty much over, I think, at this point. There's only... Two minutes or so left. Nothing really happens anymore. I've got the the choppers as my score streaks. I don't really use them anymore. The the escordone is pretty much useless. The only thing that's probably better about the escordone than the stealth chopper is that it's pretty much there instantly when you call it in, and the chopper actually takes I don't know like a half a minute or so to come into the map. Probably not even half a minute, like 15 seconds or so. But if you are in a hurry to get your streaks in, because you I don't know, because the the game's close and you can use the score streak. If it's there right away, you can use it to your advantage and actually win the game. Like turn the tides in the match. But um, usually that's not the case for me. So what I've been using, actually since I reset my stats, I've been using a one one lethal kill streak. I think it's the stealth chopper. Then I've got the UAV and the counter UAV right now. Because it's so much easier to get high scores. Actual scores, not like high kills. Uh, with non lethal streaks, because as long as you can stay alive for a little bit, if you call in a UAV, 30 seconds, your teammates get 10 kills, and you do that like 8 times in a match, that's about a thousand points already right there. So, that's what I've been doing with that, that's a really good thing if you want to get your score per minute up, or just want to get through the levels quickly, it doesn't really matter what game type you're playing, as long as you can actually get those streaks, so TDM might be a bit difficult, free throw might be a bit difficult for some people, but um, yeah, just use those score streaks, just those on lethals, don't even need hardline, because even if he said it's only 1200 points I think, so you can probably get that once every match, at least, if you kind of get used to it, uh, the streak loadout, and kind of stay back whenever you need to, and don't just rush into areas when you only need one more kill to get one of those streaks, but um, game's actually over, uh, like I said, hope you enjoyed it, if you did, give it a like, leave a comment, subscribe for more, and peace.